like this video in the next 3.5 seconds if you want 1,000 toilet paper. 1,000. This is a scam, by the way. Fake giveaway. No toilet paper for you guys. Today, we got a top 10 video, guys. Top 10 skins, soldier skins in COD Mobile. My top 10 favorite, guys. It was super hard to choose 10 because there's a lot of cool skins. And I'm not talking about the spec up one. It's not in my top 10, of course, but I did. I did my homework. I did look at all my skins. I wrote down my favorite skins and I try to place it in order. But let's get started, guys. I'll give you guys my top 10 personal favorite skins. And at the end, leave a comment below and let me know your top three. You're going to see it's not so easy, guys. So let's go with number 10. My number 10 is Ruined Jungle. It had to be in my top 10 list because I used it a lot in the past, especially with the Headless Rider skin. The combo is perfect. Let me show you. That is the combo, guys. S36 Headless Rider or whatever you like, Chikam Headless Rider. And the Headless Rider backpack to go with that. Super awesome combo. And this dude is pretty badass, by the way. I love the skin, the accessories and stuff, uh, and the very unique haircut. No, but seriously, I used it a lot. It was uh, my number five loadout, my S36 loadout for a very, very long time until I get another one. But yeah, let me know in the comments how you like that one. And I know some guys will ask me how you get these skins. Well, that one was a special offer. It was a direct buy, by the way. It was not crates, no gambling, just a straight up buy in the shop for something like $7 maybe. I can't remember, but yeah, my number 10. Ruin Jungle, and let's go with number 9. Now, number 9 is Merc 5. That one is super OG. One of the old skins on pre-season 1 in the beta, soft launch. Uh, you had to reach Legendary in Rank Multiplayer to get that one. And then the season was cut short, so a lot of players never got a chance to have it. But then it came back in crates. It's uncommon, so it was not super hard to get by opening a few crates. And it came back again in crates, so it wasn't crates twice, but still one of my favorite skins of all time. I like the colors, I like the outfit, I like the mask or whatever that is. It's always been one of my favorites and I use it once in a while on my rushing loadouts. I think it fits the SMG style. So yeah, number 9, Merc 5. Let's go to number 8. My number 8 is Spec Ops 4. This is also pretty OG and kind of rare. This one was also available in soft launch, but it never came back. Now, I don't know if they will bring it back somehow in crates or Battle Royale again. Now, once again, this one's pretty badass. The face paint, all the details. Uh, these skins have a lot of details, a lot of work put into it. And yeah, badass and rare. Gotta love that one. My number seven is the Captain skin. It's a rare skin and you don't see that one very often. I think it came twice in the shop and once again, no crates. It was direct buy for something like less than $10 the first time. Second time there was a weapon in the offer. It was a bit more expensive. Uh, but yeah, I like that one. I use it very often in Battle Royale. I like the color because it's very light, like camo white or something, white and gray. And I think it fits perfectly with the snow parts of the map. Uh, I use it in multiplayer also. But yeah, it's one of these skins that I always seem to come back to it. And yeah, again, I really love that one. Now my number six is the Elite PMC. And it's got the same kind of loadout as the Captain on the, the right shoulder. The FA0513. Uh, the CB in the back and the stuff at the bottom. It's pretty much the same outfit. But the mask and the face mask, the gas mask, the goggles is uh, very unique. It's the only one in the game like that. Now that one was available in the shop, a direct buy straight for COD points. And I think it was 1200 COD points. Uh, pretty decent price for a cool skin like that. And also a uh, kind of OG. It was there at global launch and in soft launch. Uh, it's always been one of my favorites, even when we keep adding new skins. This is one of the skins that I always have in mind when people ask me what are my favorite skins in the game. So Elite PMC, one of my personal favorites. Now at number five, our first female skin in my top 10, and there's more than one you will see later, but the Urban Tracker guys, when I saw that one for the first time, 
and I saw it in game for the first time, I was like, wow, it's much better than I thought. The I like to say it's a gamer girl with the gaming headset, but seriously, uh, very, very nice look. Nice outfit, nice uh, accessories, details, the colors and stuff. I don't use her because it's pretty common, but still, I think it's one of the best looking skins in the game right now. She's on my top five. I really, really like her. And my number four is the Battery Half Pipe Valentine. Another one that was, uh, I would say love at first sight, but uh, first time I saw the, the spoiler or the leak, uh, yeah, I like the outfit, the snowboarding outfit. And when you select it in the loadout, she has like a, a dance move or something. Well, first of all, she has a pose like that. But yeah, the, the kissing emote, the heart emote. And then yeah, she takes that pose. So very few skins have something unique like that. So yeah, one of my favorite skins, guys. It's my number four right now. Now let's go for the top three. My number three, guys, is the Seraph Freak Show. I really like that one. It came out for the Lunar New Year, Chinese New Year. But the thing is, like, people don't like these colorful skins because when you play multiplayer, you're kind of a target when the colors are bright. Now, because of that, I don't use her that much in ranked multiplayer, but still, the looks I love, and it's one of my favorite skins right now. Now, my number two, guys, Dead Angel Alice. I know it's controversial. I know a lot of you guys don't like that one. I've seen so many comments. The first day I bought that one, a lot of guys in the comments says why you buy that skin is ugly as hell it sucks and whatever but yeah another female skin on the top 10 and it's the only skin i use right now guys it's my five loadouts i use her in zombies battle royale dead angel at least i don't know why for real i don't even know why the tattoos are not even great like they don't look like real tattoos and the inside of the arms are not tattooed but usually when you have tattoo sleeves it covers the whole arm like not just not just the outside like it's the the whole arm so that's a bit weird but still i like the tape mags on the arms the grenades the belt but the mask i guess it's the mask i don't know there's something about it i really like it's really scary and serious you know like, you know she's here to kill <laughs> i don't know one of my favorite skins i love that one and it's the only one i use right now now let's go for my number one guys i don't know what you think it is but there's a lot of skins here that i didn't mention a lot of very cool skins ftl could have been in my top 10 it's a very nice one uh captain prize i just got like days ago also a very cool skin mason is awesome the new prophet i just got for free earlier today very cool one there's a lot of nice skins but i had to choose only 10. let's go for my number one my number one, Firebreak Karat Teeth. And I tell you why, guys. It's very, very cool. It's got a dance move. Uh, it's the first skin that has suits that you can equip or unequip. So you see, even without the bunny suit, this skin is freaking awesome. It's really cool. I think maybe it's even cooler without the equipment. Uh, I love the mask. I love the bulky outfit with the metal plates uh very nice like demolition expert or something the bunny outfit is just an extra and it was kind of cheap if you did buy that one in the lucky draw you did not have to buy the whole draw and get all the outfit to get the base skin and the base skin is freaking awesome now with the outfit it's also very cool i know some guys say it looks stupid but it's my number one for so many reasons like i said it's the first one that we can equip uh suit body body suits and uh hats now i'm looking forward to more of these in the future it was the first one i don't know if they intend to do more but the feature is in the game so i'm expecting more in the future so once again agree or disagree it was very hard to choose only 10 there's so many skins i don't have them all but there's a lot of cool ones and after choosing 10 it was also hard to choose the top three and top one uh yeah i decided to go for that one alice could have been my number one also a lot of female skins in the top 10 there's a lot of nice ones and uh yeah a lot of skins that didn't make the top 10 so once again leave a comment below let me know your top three skins in call of duty mobile i usually read all the comments as much as possible but thank you guys so much for watching hope you enjoyed if you did smash the like subscribe to the channel for more call of duty mobile 
I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.